If you don't know a little bit about the Wrigley Building, it sits right on Michigan Avenue, uh, right on the Chicago River. Uh, it is a historic landmark and a beacon within the city. Uh, it's 99 years old. We were asked to um, look at how, without infringing on the historic nature of the building, we could add new types of lighting. The best way that we could think of this was to scan the facade, uh, particularly the courtyard. By using Matterport, we would be able to um, create a detailed scan of the building safely, uh, and probably most importantly, very quickly. For this exterior, the Leica BLK360 was used. Everything was shot from the ground or from a window. Uh, There's no cranes or anything really out of the ordinary, which gave us enough capture. I think it was for about four stories. We received a link to the scan and the matter pack, which provided us with the point cloud, but probably more importantly for us, the mesh model, which we could then quickly bring into Rhino and quickly begin to cut sections and understand the profiles of the terracotta and the highly detailed facade of the Wrigley building. With the Matterport and being able to scan, we can capture all of that information that lets us create more sound design solutions that can be simulated with 3D models, enhanced by 3D models. But the backing of the data, the point clouds that are there, gives us a level of being sure that we've done the best job and are delivering the right solution.